Do you hear his voice? Do you know his voice? Are you known by him? Or you just heard about him? Does he know you? Does he speak to you? I remember um, I was in my early 20s and uh, I had this dream. And in the dream, I was standing inside something. And as far as I could see, there was nothing. And, but I knew I was inside something. Everywhere I looked was empty and barren. And I look up and there's all these blackbirds in the sky like crows. And I'm looking at them and then I realized they're not crows, they're people. And they got long black wings and I'm just looking at them, looking up. And then one comes down feet first and he lands right in front of me and he's staring me down. And this big black figure with long black wings and then all of a sudden the face zoomed into me and I could see who it was. It was my best friend, his name's Kevin Thompson. And then I heard this voice said, Kevin is dead. Boom, I woke up. It was just after 5 a.m. I ran downstairs, I'm calling him on the phone. No answer, no answer, no answer. I run out, I get in my car, I drive down there. After a little while, freaking out and crying. And then I go, I go down there. And as soon as I pull up, I noticed the lights were on in the house. It was just getting light out. It's around 6 a.m. I walk in the door and there's Kevin's brother packing up all his stuff in boxes. And I said, so where's Kevin? He said, you must know, what are you doing here at 6 a.m.? I said, know what? He said, Kevin died in a car accident a few hours ago. So I go out to my car and I'm thinking about that. If a man can have a vision about the future, there must be destiny. And if there's destiny, there has to be a God. And right there, it just hit me. I knew there was a God. Praise the Lord. If you haven't come to the Lord Jesus Christ, you need to do so right now in a prayer of repentance for your sins. For we're living in the end times. God bless.